right, so it is August 6th and I am driving to Hurricane, Utah. And the plan for this week, I guess, next couple weeks is I'm gonna go down the Grand Canyon. So I'm pretty excited about that. Uh, my friend Kyle invited me on the trip. Uh, I've been invited a few times in the past and I've just never, ever been able to make my schedule work for it. So when the opportunity came up this time, I jumped on it. So here we are, I'm on my way out of Pinedale. I've got just under an eight hour drive to get to Hurricane. And then we will load some stuff up, get things rigged, and then we launch on August 8th. So here's to a long drive. Mr. Kyle. Hey. What's going on? Go down the Grand, uh, finish up the last prep, load everything, and then we're leaving at 12. Uh, rigging the, when we get there, camping out at the uh, Reese Ferry, and then launching in the morning. How many times have you been down the Grand? This is number five. What are you looking forward to the most? Um, uh, being with you guys, honestly. The, the kayaking, pros. just the, um, the places, the the little, little side things that you find that are just um, amazing. It's uh, just so peaceful, so beautiful. Uh, amazing adventure. Cool. Yeah. Mr. Skyler, how many times have you been down the Grand Canyon? Zero. Okay. It's the first time. And so what are you looking forward to? Uh, just being out in the desert for a week and a half, getting away from everything and uh, getting wet so paddle rafting yeah yeah we, we couldn't secure the topo duo couldn't couldn't pull it off we, last we, minute we, we thought about it too late yeah so why Kyle why did you want to take the topo duo uh, I don't know if any I, I'm sure someone's done it but not no one I know and it'd be fast I wanted to serve I want to catch hermit on it I think that'd be cool well, okay, I'll tell you what's going on. Yeah, what's going on, John? So it's Saturday, August 6th. We're in Hurricane, Utah at Kyle's Uncle Walt, right? Uncle Walt's house. So tomorrow we're going to head down to Lee's Ferry, is that what it's called? Lee's Ferry, rig up the rafts, and then we launch on the 8th to go down the Grand Canyon. I've been down the Grand Canyon, heard good things. Looking forward to it. One, I just think the the scale of the the trip, you know, bigger water, longer water, like 300 miles, I guess is what you said. And then I'm hoping we just come across some epic play waves to just surf like crazy. So I brought my Crazy 88, threw the fins on it because it's kind of a gimmick, but. It might be a cool gimmick on the Grand Canyon, who knows. Hey, John. We made it here. The boats are still on top. It's good news. My knots worked. <laughs> All right, I'm a little more confident in it now that we're here. <laughs>
yeah, and by his sister, just gonna stand there and pretend to have a wild man. Then we'll have another table if we would be prefer preferably is to have another table right here. That'd be like a little prep, and then we'd have another one that would be for dishes. It is August 8th, it's the day we launch. So we spent the night at Lee's Ferry. Um, just rigged up the boat and then literally floated 400 meters down river and unloaded everything and camped there. Uh, we have to do a check-in this morning before we can officially launch. Um, so I just slept out on the ground last night, but the wind picked up. It was really, really windy for probably like at least half hour, 45 minutes. I just got sandblasted. I just feel like everything's covered with sand, which might be the story of the trip. Um, and I got this morning and went and used the restroom and brushed my teeth and got freaking stung by a scorpion. First thing, didn't even see it. I was just washing my face and my hands and it was apparently underneath the sink and stung me right on my toe. I got stung right there. So if you're wondering what it feels like to be stung by a scorpion, it's like the cross between getting stung by a bee and your toe smashed with a hammer. Like that's kind of the feeling right now. Um, pain level's probably three times the amount of a normal sting from a bee. But anyways, um, just trying to walk it off a little bit. Are you gonna? A frog. A little toad. <laughs>
the university. Yeah. Thank you. 